Hello, it's Diamond, person that you go to for all of your health and fitness needs. So today I want to talk to y'all about a new remedy that I have came across. So recently I just got into studying more about essential oils and their healing powers. So I have been using uh, the doTERRA brand of essential oils and I just want to show y'all like so I had I ordered a healthy start kit right so it came with 10 oils so it came and I y'all I didn't use all of these oils just use them up like so it came with a deep blue this is a soothing blend um, it helps with like joint pain and muscle pain um, it's really good for like relaxing the body it came with frankincense. I lo I just got hip to frankincense, y'all. Like, um, frankincense is very good for healing. It's a grounding oil. Um, it's a lot of health benefits to frankincense. Uh, I have a tea tree. You know, tea tree is really good. It has its uh, antibacterial properties. I have. This is the On Guard. This is a protective blend, so it's a really good good for like immune boosting. Um, I had a little lavender in here. It was a lavender in here about this size. I used all of that, so I had to order me another lavender, and it's way it's way bigger. Um, but lavender right now is like my favorite essential oil. It's really good. I put it on the bottom of my feet, and it really helps with my anxiety. Um, especially like I just had a baby, so like I was dealing with a lot of postpartum too. Um, and the postpartum depression and the using the lavender helped calm me down. So lavender has been like one of my top oil, top favorites out of the essential oils so far. Um, oh, here go my little lavender right here. <laughs> um, but it's empty. It come with a digestive blend, oregano, and a lemon. So that's just, you know, just a quick... So that's my healthy start kit and I, I've been using these in a diffuser. I've been using them topically. I've been taking them in, internally. Um, so, but the ones that I want to talk to you today about are my oregano and the lemon. So I was already like putting the drops of lemon in my water because just drops of lemon in and water in the morning time just help with like detoxifying your body. So um, I was already doing the lemon, right? So then, like a couple days ago, I got a really bad sore throat. Like I'm talking, it was swollen on bilaterally both sides. I had like white pockets on the back. It was hard to swallow. I could not swallow solids. It was just, it was really bad. Like, no, I don't have COVID. Um, I guess it was just like a case of like tonsillitis or allergies, whatever it may be. I felt terrible. I did not have a fever. So, um, usually when we get sick like that, you know, we, we going straight to the pharmacy, we get some over the counter drugs like, uh, Theraflu or what is that other one? Uh, the one for mucus. Yeah. Y'all know which one I'm talking about. The, you know, we're, we're, we're getting medications that's helping to relieve sore throat. Um, we getting like the menthol cough drops, all types of all that stuff. Right. So. Since I started using the doTERRA and I was talking to my friend, Karen, and she was like, oh, use your oil. So, and we have this book where it breaks down like how to medicinally use the essential oils. So she helped me find, um, you know, like tonsillitis in the book. This little book right here is like my essential oil Bible, but it has all of, you know, like ailments in here and it'll tell you how to resolve the ailments through the essential oil. So I actually thought that I had, I was like, this feels like strep because I've had tonsillitis, tonsillitis before, but I'm like, maybe it's just strep. So I looked up strep and it took me to sore throat, but it also helped with strep. And it told me to use, um, for a strong case, which it was this time, it told me to use oregano, lemon, and lavender, right? So I was using, so I made me a cup of hot water and I'm doing it again today just to like make sure I'm good. But I made me a cup of hot water and I literally put two drops of oregano, 
two drops of lemon and one drop of lavender in my hot water. And I did it for, let's see, I got sick on like Monday night. So Tuesday when I woke up, my throat was banging. Like it was really banging by Tuesday. So um, Tuesday through Friday, I did this like three times, two to three times a day. And by Friday evening, my throat was back to about like 95%. And it was just amazing like how fast it worked. It was completely natural. Um, the lavender actually helped soothe like with the pain. Like it, it calmed me down. Um, it soothes the pain in my throat. The oregano has very strong healing properties. Now, I've heard, like, before that oregano was really good when it came to, like, respiratory illnesses or just, like, sickness in general. So, this was my first time really using oregano. It's very strong. Like, it got, like, some spice to it or something because it, it, I felt, like, some burning on my lip. But after I let it, you know, cool down a little bit, just a little bit because I wanted to drink it hot, it wasn't as bad. But the oregano is very, very pungent. Like the smell took up the whole room. Like it was very strong. But these three right here. And I'm perfectly fine now. So like by the second day, by the second day, um, my, my, the pain in my throat moved from it being bilateral to just unilateral so it was on both sides at first and then by the second day i was only feeling pain on one side the pain the swelling and um the white pockets and then literally by the third day it was pretty much gone and the rest of it was just like just keeping up with it to make sure that it was um it was gone and it's completely gone i didn't have to go to the doctor uh, I did not have to go to CVS or Rite Aid or anything like that to get any over-the-counter drugs. And, yeah, this is what I used. I used oregano, lavender, and lemon. And it was completely natural. Like I said, the doTERRA brand of essential oils are very pure, so um, you can ingest them. And that's, that's what I like about this brand because when you buy... Um, essential oils out of the store like you don't really know what you're getting and if they say you can't use them internally then that means that there's something else in them that isn't natural so um yeah that's my testimony to for today for today um regarding the essential oils i'm still studying up on them you know and just trying them out but i've been using them in the diffuser um, I've been taking them internally and then I've been using them topically too. And I'm very pleased with it. They're, they're very potent. Essential oils are derived straight from the plants. Okay. So they're distilled, they're dis the distilled form of the plants. Okay. So you have your herbs and then you got your essential oils. Your essential oils are basically like the distilled version of the herbs. So they're very potent and they're actually, to me, they're stronger and they work faster. So yes um but yeah sore throat tonsillitis strep throat oregano lemon and some lavender and if that if this is my disclaimer if that does not work for you then go see a physician but a physician to help you know treat whatever it is that you have going on but for me me personally i always want to uh like self medicate myself first but i'm gonna self-medicate my way the natural way and if that doesn't work which it usually does work though then i'll consult with the physician to you know do what i need to do but yeah um this pretty much took it out okay and i encourage you to i encourage you to start using essential oils you know at first i thought they were just something you put in the diffuser or something you just you know help calm you down, help your room smell good a little bit, but no, they actually have great medicinal properties that help heal the body from the inside out and um, in a natural way. So you're not putting more toxins and more chemicals inside of your body. And that's what Gym Bodies is all about anyway, right? So healing from the inside out, the most natural way um, that you can. So yeah, essential oils, Y'all better get on it. Get on it, okay? And...
I got me another cup right here. I'm I'm starting my week off with it just to, you know, get the rest of it. I like I'm I'm pretty much like 99% back, but that 1%, I just got to So I'm going to drink me some like I said. And I put